Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Tales of Arise. As you can tell, I am still quite sick, but... <clears throat> I already took my, uh... Sick days off. No point in taking any more. Besides, I want to play. I just may not sound the greatest. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Yep. All right, what's the boss? Big again, Quill. What do you think this place was for? <laughs> Whoa. Dude, it's like Gurren Logan. What the hell? Are they asleep? No, they appear to be well preserved. However, they are all dead. Dead? So this is... a mass grave? Looks that way. However, none of them appear to be Helganquil. Bear in mind that Renans were originally Danans, who were remade and sent to live on Lenigus. Knowing that, they would have needed a place to perform the procedure somewhere. And that place is here, I assume. So what you're saying is that all of these are Danon, or rather, Renin bodies? Most likely, yes. They must have been abandoned for one reason or another. There are so many of them. They were all taken away, but never given the chance to wake. Easy. It's it does give a lot of Gurren Gurren Lagann vibes, the uh, anti spiral. What the hell? What is that thing? Something we have to fight if we want to get across, it seems. Be careful! It's huge! Yeah, it's pretty naughty looking. What is with oh, all Jesus. Valkilimus. No ordinary Zubal. That much is damn sure. Watch yourself. All bets are off when it comes to this thing. So I can only attack its undercarriage. <laughs> Be polite. Got it. We we'll need to bring it down somehow to hit it. In that case, let's start with the one in the middle. It's not really that hard, I'm gonna be honest. Here's the 
Holy shit, man. The fucking damage I'm dealing to this thing. Damn it, this thing's getting fucked up. God damn, man. The hell was that? Probably something that was made here and somehow managed to survive, even after all this time. Not that there's any way of knowing now. <sighs> What's wrong? Oh, I just suddenly found myself contemplating what might have happened to the sovereigns that were meant to a- What do you mean? You see, the winners of the past crown contests were all strong astral arts practitioners. Furthermore, that enemy we just fought appeared to be composed of several human bodies. Yeah, I saw that certainly too. Certainly nothing one would find it. You're saying those were the remains of the winners? I'm merely saying- That's absolutely- It was Rena's great spirit that made them do all- <sighs> We're not gonna jump down, right? Damn, that was like an actual boss fight? That thing was fucking... That thing was a joke, man. Are you shitting me? Easier overlimit? I don't think I need easier overlimit. Forty defense isn't too shabby. Fifty defense, though, is fucking better. Yeah, more pen is really good. Counter edge upon enemy defeat. Look at this. It won't hurt. Resistance is good. There we go. Get all the fucking big ones. So what to say? I assure you all, I was merely stating the possibility. So, looks like the Helganquil have been engineering Zoogles too. Why doesn't that surprise me at this point? The creatures we've been encountering here have been a little different to what we're used to fighting. But I'm pretty sure they're Zoogles too. Do you think they were engineered using creatures native to the area? Indeed. However, based on the current circumstances, I would guess these Zoogles are all that's left of the planet's fauna now. You mean... There might have been native owl species here once upon a time, too. Right. <laughs> oh, there's gonna be some goodies. Yeah. Hmm, only one goodie. I'll take what I can get. Wait, that thing was a fucking... That thing was laughable. What the hell? I mean, I'll take, I'll take the heal. <laughs> the heal is, uh... Greatly appreciated. Wed woman. Truth. All right, now is it going to be on the other side? It's my guess. Oh, I was wrong. Unfortunate. We're back in that other room. Did the teleporter fail or something? Something feels off about it. Look! Everything's upside down. The furnishings are at least. No, you're right. The whole room's flipped on oh. its head. So what was once down is now up, and vice versa. I suppose the teleporter reversed our orientation then. Oh, nice. 
to the, oh, to the entrance. That's what that is. So I can leave if I want, which I don't think I want to. Yeah, it's just if I want to get, like, uh, to shop for stuff. Oh, ooh, big gem. Pixie crystal. That's what I wanted to check, to see if I can actually craft uh, the mystic crest. I guess I'll do that right now. I mean, might as well. I got the teleporter right here and everything. I can see where this takes me, which I think it takes me to the very beginning. Yeah, it does. Perfect, so I just go anywhere. Right here. Talk to this guy and see if I can actually make it. Looks like we made it here in one piece. Um, create an accessory. Right there. Mysterious Fragment. Water damage. Counter attack damage. No. Water damage. Coupe de Grace. What is this? Okay. Wind, light, counter attack. Okay, well, this is going to run well. I mean, like, right? Yeah. Attack plus 60. Plus 60? Hold on. Nice. I'm stunned. That's one of the last fucking things you want to pretty 60, though. What do I have on Maw? 15%. Which is 144. Right. Three, one. Wanna sit down and fix something? That's pretty good. No, I don't want those. Cover one CP from the enemy defeat. That's not bad. Heal five HP, five percent. Elemental attack. Attack fifteen. Plus twenty. No. Light and dark magic. Damn. Wind. Wind damage. It's up by a lot. Not. Hmm. Yeah, this is still probably gonna go to Ridwell. Well. Hmm. Let's use all this shit. There we go. Elemental attack by 15. So I lose. A lot. But I'll be able to cast them more frequently. Because this increases the casting time. So we'll try this for a bit. See if I notice any difference. Alright, can I make yep. any, uh... I can. Punisher's Vembrace. Oh, that looks cool. Dark Tree Blood. Oh, what the fuck is that? That's an ugly-ass sword. That's a cooler sword. Phone, shut up.
I mean, I suppose I'll make that. Just... I'll make these for now. Sure. Better. All my fucking money is gone, but... You know, what are we gonna do? <coughs> we'll get more uh, life bottles. Yeah, there we go. Uh, then I uh, will rest up, you I can guess. Never be too prepared. All right, so I need to do shit with Dolholim, right? Why are you staring at me? Oh, heal after battle. Earn combat points. I mean, that's pretty good. I should do that just to finish everything up. This shall suffice. Lost the smiley face. I want to get these three, but. Dolholim. I gotta do Dolholim because the game wants me to. Another fine day. Tell me, it's better than being enslaved. You don't get the shackle a man's feet, and you. Then there was the food. What about you? Is that a hint of interest in my? I guess that's well. Certainly, start. I even had help getting in and out of clothes. That's quite the downgrade you've made. This might surprise you, but I actually don't find our current. My own hardships paled in comparison. <laughs> Forgive me. True, Ren and Opulence doesn't feature high on my sympathy list. I suppose it's not. You pay me no heed. Not whatever my past. It is. You know, I will you say best though. Get ready for tomorrow. Dolly may not be like my favorite character to play, but he certainly is one of the more intriguing characters overall. Eating. Right? Because he was literally royalty. Yes. Yeah, because this man was literally royalty, and he was like, "No, nah, let me, let me go venture out with some, going. With, 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 with these dirty people, vagabonds, because I kind of believe in what they're doing." In a way, you gotta respect it, right? He's not perfect. He's a little clueless and a little socially incompetent at times. But I mean, you gotta respect him. It's weird how frail he is, though. For how strong he's supposed to be, he is very frail, which is strange. I guess this is. Holy shit! The flip side of that pathway we were walking on just a little while ago. Yeah, hooray! This is crazy. Who knew such amazing oh. technology existed? Well, you're new. Astral doubt. No oh, it's just tormented limbs. Wow. I'll crush you. Lightning reflexes. Tenebrous claw. Damn. Wow, for doing so much damage. That did not affect the health bar that much. What are you weak to? Like, Fucked. Lady Fortune must truly be watching over me. Uh, 
and send it pebble. They look like Shion's thorns, and with flowers. Not real ones, though. They're just like that flower girl. We must be getting close to the Great Spirit. Hey, Rinwell, what was that thing you said? Right. That's why Dana's Great Spirit is so much more... diluted. Weak, even. Whether it was a choice so it didn't overpower others, or just the way it is, is anyone's guess. If that's true, then wouldn't it mean Dana's will could never form under natural conditions? Yeah. Sounds like that's probable. So if Dana exists within all of us, then what if something occurred that brought everyone's hearts and minds? That unity could potentially act as- You mean if everybody was like, thinking the exact same thing at the exact same time? Come on, there's no way we could pull that off. I know it's a long shot, but it might work. Let's assume that's even possible for a second. Would it even be enough to fight back against Rena's great- If nothing else, it might be an option if we can't use the Rena's Alma. Things are different here than on the surface. That shows how deeply we've ventured into Rena. And how close we've come to the real enemy. Oh, that's a lot of them. So here's a question. We came all this way to Rena on the assumption the Rena's Alma's here, right? Don't. Just don't say it, Law. Yeah, but I'm just saying... I said don't. <laughs> I can understand why you might be concerned, Law. But you need to remember that there are people it affects more directly than you. <sighs> oh. We've managed to make it this far believing. Losing faith now won't do us- Such as? The Great Spirit. If Hevrecht 35's to be believed, our enemy won't just be handing over the Renus Alma to us. Not only that, but that same enemy just... Hmm. It may be strange to say, but when I'm fighting, or at least know what needs to be done, it helps me a lot. I don't doubt myself as much. So thanks. Both of you. Oh, uh, okay. Another one, sure. <sighs> the floor's on the ceiling and the ceiling's on the floor. The Helganquil can bend life forms to suit their will. Nothing they could do at this point. The ceiling is on the floor! What good is a team made up of members who all share the same opinions on everything? And besides, when you get to be at my ripe old age... Old age! To consider it Dude, you're like 22. To true emotions at times. Oh, come on, Grandpa! Uh, he's like 20 or maybe 30. The sands of time wait for none of us, lad. Yeah, we'll see. Bullshit. This rate, you're like fucking... You're 25. To get as old as you first. You will. And when the time comes, I look forward to... Like, Law, I would say, like, at most, Law's, like, 17. 17, 18. All right, sure, let's do this guessing game. So, Law's, like, 17, 18. Uh, Rinwell, I would say, maybe, like, 19, 20. Alfin and Shion, I'd say, are 22 to 5. Dolhalim and Kinsara, I'll bump them up. They're 30 to 35. I refuse to believe they're anything older than that. <laughs> Astro Sloth. Damn. Hitting them all. Damn! Fucking keep the grave train growing. Damn, they all. Hey, I'm pretty lucky. Got messed the hell up. Nice. I'll take that pineapple chill. Damn, three platinums. Not bad money. What the fuck are you? You are an angry chicken. Astral agony. Is this a joke? I know it's a hell chicken. Oh, 
the word defeat. Ready. Denied. Annihilation. In a bind. Mega ray. Shiny supernova. Great so high. More where that came from. Look sharp. Back him up. Yeah, shut up, Turkey. Good lord. I know fine weapon material when I see it. Million hide. All right, you were a lot easier to fight, though. So, Agony, this one's Doubt. We're going through all the negative emotions and the enemies, I assume. Yeah, fuck him up. That does solid damage too. Inferno Punch does like a thousand a pop, and it's very fast. That's not bad damage either. We're still standing, barely. Ooh. Astral Lament. Again. I told you. Lies, son. Stop. Shame you're not like that all the time. 
Oh shit. Yeah, when I add Inferno Punch into all that, it actually becomes a pretty decent combo. This should come in handy when crafting weapons. A number stone. Oh Jesus, do I even have enough? I have just enough. Perfect. Fairy ring. This might be some Level one. Art cost twenty percent. Kinda <laughs> bad. Uh oh, I have some things. Endurance. Yeah, I gotta give that to you. It does work good with Alphan, but considering I don't use him, I gotta give it to the one who needs it. And then penetration. Also really good on Rinwell. But Law's gotta go. Anyway, and with that, I think we're time. Yes, we are. To end this episode. So anyway, I hope you all had a wonderful time. I hope you all had a good time. I hope you all have a good time. Until we meet again, I hope you have a fucking time. I fucked the outro out, but I'm sick, so I don't care. Peace.